what's up scorpio and welcome to my channel i hope all of my beautiful and my handsome scorpios out there are doing well all right y'all we're gonna pull some messages from my i am dick okay this is a dick that i created i don't know last year you guys all right, so let's pull some messages and see what spirit wants you to know. If anything resonates, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment, okay? Especially subscribe if you have not. And anything that you want to know about me, the intros, Rose Forever, okay? The link to the shop, you guys, is in the description box below, okay? Go check them out. And anything else you want to know, we'll be there. All right, you guys, so let's go. All right, Scorpio, so we have healing, okay? So some of you could be healing from some things in your past. You know, the full moon in Aries, which is today, okay? And, you know, Aries kind of represents that that warrior energy, okay? So even though some of you guys are still trying to be a warrior, it's like you're, you're needing to heal from something so that you can have the new beginning, okay? Aries has to do with new beginnings. You could be seeing a lot of ones, okay? One, one, one. But I feel like spirit is encouraging you to heal, continuously healing on this journey okay because this is going to be very important for you some of you are going to be put in a position to where you're going to be a leader or you're going to be put in a leadership role okay and if you haven't healed from all of the hurt pain the abandonment whatever issues that you suffer from in the past like you're not going to be that that what's the word i'm trying to use here you're not going to be that leader that spirit can use you see what i'm trying to say like, spirit wants to use you, but you got to heal first, okay? I feel like this will give you a, a better understanding of your life. Like, once you really heal, and once we really heal, Scorpio, we'll understand a lot of shit. We'll understand why our lives, even from jump, started out fucked up for some of us. You know what I'm saying? But it's like, some of us, we feel like our lives been hard. It has been hard. Our whole life has been hard. But it's like, once you get this fully under, like, once... Once spirit shows you this bigger picture and the role that I feel like they want you to play, you'll understand, okay, I had to go through those things. If I didn't endure that hurt and pain, I wouldn't be able to help other people on my path who have endured the same thing. Because Scorpio, I feel like we're healers. You know what I'm saying? I feel like a lot of us, we're going to have some type of position to where we're healing. Whether you can be reading for other people, you can be doing crystals, you know what I'm saying? You can be doing yoga, like whatever you're doing, whatever energy work that you're doing, you're going to be healing people, okay? And I feel like it's all going to start with taking a leap of faith. Once you get this understanding, okay, spirit going to be like, all right, well, let's go. Like, you guys, that's kind of how I started off on YouTube. Like, I was introduced to tarot. Like, I, I feel like I was in training for about a year, a little over a year. Like, spirit had me watching certain readers, you know, to kind of, Pick up on, like, because I didn't know nothing about none of these shit, you guys. I had to learn to read the email address. I didn't know what I needed an email address for. I never had Cash App. I didn't get Cash App until I got YouTube. Like, I learned from other readers. Like, it wasn't even just about the messages. Like, I literally was training. Like, they had me watching. It was it was funny because they only had me watching a particular few. And I, I even now, I listen to readers. And some readers, I don't even listen to the same readers, you know, that I used to. When I first started out, I feel like, you know, some people just put on my path that they had me just watching certain people so that I can learn certain aspects. Like, I didn't know you can create your own cards. You know, once I saw that, I was like, oh, yeah. Like, my homeboy still left me this day. He was like, man, it's just, like, he feels it's just so beautiful. He was like, man, it was like, I just told you about this shit. And he was like, I remember you saying, I can do this shit. And he said, next thing I know, bitch, you was doing this shit. <laughs> he was like, you was doing that shit. So I feel like, like, it's a bigger picture to what you're going through. And it's like, once you see that bigger picture, you really get this deep understanding of why your life was the way it was, why it seemed so hard, because it wasn't going to be hard forever. But Spirit needed us to learn to have faith. He needed us to learn to trust, you know what I'm saying? And to never give up, to have courage, to have faith, to take this leap of faith. Because when you step into the unknown, when I step into the unknown on YouTube, you guys, I had no idea that a year later I would have over 5,000 subscribers and 
you know, I would be in the place that I'm in now and I'm helping people. You guys, I looked a couple of weeks ago. My channel has gotten over a million views. You know what I'm saying? Like these, I, I never expected this shit, you guys. I promise to God and I promise to God now. Everything that I do, you guys, this shit, I feel like it's God. Like, you know, like I feel like Holy Spirit has been guiding me this whole way on my path. And they led me right here to YouTube so that I can help you guys. And y'all be a blessing to me. Like this is a, a two-way street with us. You know, I may be the reader, but shit, a lot of you guys, you encourage me. On my path, I go through shit just like y'all do. You know what I'm saying? My, I don't never claim my life to be, you know what I'm saying, roses and all that shit because it's not. You know what I'm saying? We all here in the same boat together. Okay, I want, I, want, I need my finances to be straight. Okay, <laughs> I'm waiting on love. I'm waiting on all this shit. So we all, we all a family because we all wait on this shit together. Okay. All right, Scorpio. So let's get into it. Let's see what spirit wants us to know. Oh shit, we got mad, Scorpio. Ah, we got one, two, three, four, five. Is that five, six mask? So you could have been dealing with six people, Scorpio, or you could have been dealing with this one person who did not want to be their true, authentic self. Because you see, this woman has on white. Okay, white talks about being pure, being genuine. You know what I'm saying? Being your authentic self, having pure intentions. So I feel like you were dealing with somebody who could have been wearing up to six masks, Scorpio. You could have been dealing up to six people here. But it was like every time you were around this person, they had a different mask on. You saw a different version of this person. So you were sitting back like, who the fuck is this person? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You didn't know who you were really dealing with because it was like each encounter you had with this person, that they were wearing a mask. And it was like this person was really trying to cover up their ways like maybe someone here didn't feel safe within themselves like they felt they had to wear a mask to be accepted okay so this could have been something this person has done for a long time so dealing with you scorpio it wasn't just you like this is someone who i feel like they don't know how to be there like this is how they hide this is what they are they really want to be their true genuine self but they feel like the people maybe that they're surrounded with they can't do this shit. so in order to be accepted Thank you, Spirit. Someone here could wear a mask because they feel like this is the only way that people were, were going to accept them for who they were, okay? So when you dealt with this person, they did you like everybody else. They wore a mask with you because they, Scorpio, felt like that you were not going to accept them for who they truly were, okay? Some of you could have been dealing with an air sign. Someone here, also Scorpio, was wearing a mask to cover up some type of lie. That they were telling you, okay? Somebody here was lying to you. And I feel like this is someone who was confused about their feelings, okay? And this is also someone who was afraid of those feelings, okay? So this is someone who felt feelings and emotions for you, but those feelings that they had confused them, them Scorpio. It confused them because. For some of you, I feel like this person was already involved with, with someone else and they didn't understand how could they meet someone else and have these strong ass feelings, have this emotional connection with someone when they already belong to somebody else. You know what I'm saying? That's what confused this person. They didn't understand this shit. Like, I'm already with somebody. I'm already married to another man or another woman. Like, how is it that... I met Scorpio, and Scorpio had me feeling all these feelings and emotions. Okay, I keep hearing, y'all, what was I did a reading the other day, or a couple of weeks ago with it, Mariah Carey, Emotions. And y'all, I was in the store the other day. It was It's crazy. Like, some of these songs that I've been doing, the messages through music, like, when I do get a chance to get out the house, I've been hearing this shit. I'm like, okay, so what does this mean? You know what I'm saying? But in that song, she says, you got me feeling emotions higher than the heavens above okay so these this is some high ass like the, the, the heavens above is high we don't even know how high it, up in the sky heaven is okay so for this person to feel those type of emotions scorpio that's deep that's real deep and i feel like this person did not understand it okay scorpio you could be seeing birds in pairs or you could be seeing things in pairs dogs Yeah, someone here was wearing this mask because it was blocking them from being vulnerable 
with you, okay? Somebody didn't really want to open up and express feelings and emotions, okay? So they feel like if they were this mask, that they really didn't have to reveal them true selves to you, okay? But they were lying to themselves, Scorpio, and they were lying. They was lying to you, and they was lying to their own damn self as well, okay? Because wearing this mask, Scorpio, has been exhausting this person. It's tired. This person's tired as hell, Scorpio, for wearing this damn mask, for being fake and fraudulent and not being their true selves. This person's tired. They tired of wearing this damn mask, okay? So someone, Scorpio, if you were dealing with someone here that was wearing a mask, okay, this means that your relationship, okay, this connection that you build with this person was based on lies. Because you didn't get to see this person be their true, authentic self. All you got to see was this person wear this damn mask. All you got to see was them interchange through all these masks, okay? But you never got to see this person's true, authentic self. You never really got to see this person, okay? So this relationship and connection that you share with this person was based on lies because they wore a mask the whole time, okay? They didn't want you to see who they truly were, okay? Tell us more, Holy Spirit. Let's get one more. Messages for my Scorpio. What is it that Scorpio needs to know? Okay. Yep. Because we got fearless love and we have naked, okay? We got 25 and 30, Scorpio. You could be 25 or 30 or 18. See, this person, when it came to love, Scorpio, they were scared of love. They weren't fearless. When you're fearless of love, that means you're willing to take leaps of faith, okay? You're willing to walk into the unknown with someone, even if you're unsure of, you know, what's going to happen in the future or what the future holds for you, okay? So someone here, Scorpio, they were scared when it came to love. And this is why this person felt the need to wear this mask, okay? They were scared of love. And this could have been from something that happened in their past, okay? Maybe they had a past experience with somebody and shit, it, it, it wasn't the best, you know what I'm saying? They could have been in a marriage or relationship to where it was a lot of, it was a toxic ass relationship or marriage, okay? There was a lot of hurt. There was a lot of pain. There was a lot of deception here. And so someone felt being with you, Scorpio, or just period. Like, I feel like this is someone who maybe tried to reveal that mask. You know what I'm saying? They really tried to be their true authentic self, but they did that shit with the wrong person. See, this person can be naked. They can bear themselves. See, Scorpio, you was naked with who you are. You're raw. You're so authentic and raw with who you are. You are the truth. Okay, a lot of us are comfortable. You learn to be comfortable, Scorpio. If you have not, you will learn to be comfortable in the skin that you're in, okay? And when you're comfortable in the skin that you're in, baby, you wear that shit with confidence. You fuck what a motherfucker got to say about you, okay? You don't give a damn because you're comfortable. You're confident in the person that you're in. But see, this person, they weren't comfortable. They weren't confident within themselves, okay? Yeah, this influences emotions and gifts, okay? Clairvoyance and healing powers. Man, come through, spirit. Some of you guys, you're healers, okay? Clairvoyance, that means you see things, you're seers. You know, just like I said, some of you are supposed to be readers, just like me. You know what I'm saying? It's like you see, and, and thing is, Scorpio, before I even got this job, because I call it a job. You know what I'm saying? This is my job that I do. I feel it. I love my job. You know what I'm saying? It's like before I was put in this position, I knew nothing. Of, I had any type of power. You know, now that I think back, okay, like maybe I had some shit and didn't know it. You know what I'm saying? We always been in tour to Scorpio. We've always had a gift. Now, will the spirit allowed us at that time to see our gift? A lot of us know because we had to go through some things. You know what I'm saying? We had to experience life before a spirit can tell us, okay, this is what you're supposed to do. This is the real reason why you were put here on this earth. Okay? Before a spirit had to break it down for us. And you can see things. It's like you receive downloads. A lot of you guys, like I do those messages through music, like a lot of messages I receive are through music. Like I tell you guys, like every day it's like a freaking radio station in my head and I don't be knowing who these messages come from. Like I'm learning to write this shit down or, you know, I make my dicks out of them from these messages. But when I give y'all these songs, I really be wanting y'all to look at the lyrics because the lyrics are so powerful. Because a lot of times you be hearing songs, you don't be knowing what the hell people saying until you actually See the lyrics, you're like, oh, shit, I've been singing this song wrong all my life. Yes, okay? <laughs> so check out lyrics to song, Scorpio, because those are the messages through music, okay? 
But it's like those downloads, Scorpio, I feel like you're healing. And as you heal, as you heal yourself, you're going to see how it, how important it was that you healed yourself because you're going to be also here to heal other people as well. Help them on their path, okay? Spirit is encouraging this person to stop hiding. You know what I'm saying? To to reveal that emotional nakedness that they've been avoiding. Because this person doesn't feel like being naked and standing in their truth. They don't feel like that's their superpower. But Scorpio, when you stand true to yourself and you know who you are and you confident, like at this woman. Look at this mermaid. Like she confident, baby. You can look at that face. That's confidence. Okay? You know that that's your superpower. And you're not ashamed. But this person, is they don't feel that them being truthful and standing in their power, they don't see that as being a superpower. They, they see that as being weak, okay? So someone here could feel like being vulnerable and all that type of stuff. That, that makes them very weak, okay? So let's see who we talking about. Let's get the, let's go to the who did. Let's go to the who did. Let's see who this reading is about. Lots of purple, Scorpio. Let me get my book. What is purple? I know purple third eye crown chakra, but this particular color is. Jeez, come on, y'all, because I got stuff everywhere. Okay, these are numbers. What my color is it? I don't know what's in here. It's numbers. Come on, y'all, let me find my colors. Okay, had I waited a few more seconds, I'd have found it. Okay. Purple. Violet, okay? Violet has to do with wisdom, beauty, inspiration, enlightenment. Okay, and this is one of the most spiritual colors. This has to do with the crown chakra. Okay, so I said that crown chakra, third eye chakra. You guys, look at all this purple, especially in this card. Look at all this purple. This is, I feel like, what you guys represent and what this person is supposed to be representing with you as well, okay? Okay, so let's see who this reading is about. I can get the cards together. Messages for my Scorpios, Holy Spirit. Who is this reading about? I love you, Scorpio. Oh, okay, so Scorpio, we got hoop earrings. They want to fly out and go back in. <laughs> okay, so you can wear hoop earrings or your person can wear hoop earrings. All right, age 40 to 45. So that could be your age or your person. We got a long beard, visible birthmark, dark brown eyes. I think I've been seeing dark brown eyes quite a bit. Who is this reading about for my Scorpios? Okay, I'm going to take all of these. All right, Scorpio, we have nice legs. We got short beards. We got a short beard, long beard. This could be fair complexion. Okay, someone who wears cowboy boots, has a mustache, they, so they can have a goatee. Whereas, uh, I'm gonna say, whereas cupcakes. <laughs> whereas wave caps, okay, and we have gold tooth or a gold teeth. All right, so let's see the signs. Who is this reading about? All right, we got Cancer, Scorpio, Leo, Sag. We got Taurus, Libra, Cancer, and Pisces. And we also got Taurus, Heavy Capricorn, and Virgo. So all the Earth signs. All right, you guys, I love you. And until next time, stay blessed.